Hi everybody and welcome to a new episode of Fortress Craft Evolved Frozen Factory where you can see my world settings, my name is HMK and we're going to go and have a look at a slight problem that we've got today. Now if you look at this um, cargo, this uh, container, this is actually full, okay, um, and it's starting and stopping. Okay, and that's because we've got tin, copper, and iron on constant um, go with the uh, better header. So the the thing that we're going to do is to have to upgrade uh, this smelter. Okay, and we're going to show you how to do that today because it, it's a, it's a really really simple thing. Um, forced induction here. Okay, so we need some copper and tin. Okay, so hopefully, because we were running out of space in this one, so we actually got uh, this here. So hopefully we have got enough to get the induction. Yeah, so you're going to craft the induction there. And then what you're going to be doing is you're going to go to your um, indu inductor, which is that one. You're going to put it on the top there. Okay, now what you're going to watch is you're going to have a look at uh, this time here. Okay, and this is going to go a lot quicker. Okay, you see? Just a lot, lot quicker there. And what we're looking for is this. Is we're looking to see to make sure if this goes down. Now if this goes down, which you can see it, it, it kind of clearly is then it, it's done its job so that means technically we can start pushing more ore through okay um, okay so we have got uh, there you go let me see so even if we put these in and make it a um, hundred Right, so we're now on 100, it's now stopped, yeah. But you're going to just see just how quickly this goes by just having that induction on. But what you've got to be careful of is um, your energy, okay? You need to make sure that you keep that HUD power supply up, okay? Now, currently, uh, we do that with having uh, a dedicated uh, coal line, okay, to the uh, to the furnace and we only have two in there uh, ten in there sorry that's it that's all, all we have we don't have anything else in there so that's that's the induction furnace and uh, if you have a look at it you see look gone down again gone down straight away so the speed that this is coming in at now yeah for our uh, members here right for here Okay, it's, it's still okay. Yeah. Alright, it's still okay there. But we all want to start thinking possibly not uh, not uh, not too much about uh, what's going to happen because you can still see that this is not full. This is not jam packed. So, yeah. We're doing okay. But that's the induction I just wanted to show you that because look we're now down to 56 so there you go we put 43 in there and we still can fit more in I'm just waiting for it to fill up you see look we've got 19 bits there I'm just waiting until I can fit these other 18 in there and then uh, and then that's it you see so we should be able to put those in now still still waiting for seven so once it's done done one more I always like pushing things through really really do so there we go so what, what we're also going to do um, as well is um, 
so we can put lithium on as well and not really have uh, a bother with it is we're going to make a, another hopper okay and we're going to make wait until we've got two more tin because it just means I can go downstairs then pick up the lithium and then come back up here and not have to worry about it okay and that is really the uh, thing that you uh, want to want to have so we just need two more tin one tin one copper one iron one tin one copper one iron and also what you'll probably notice as well is um, we look at the suit power pack we will be looking to be doing this as well shortly right so let's just see so there we go so we're just going to do that there and uh, we're just going to now create that okay and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to add it to the line okay just going to add it to the line okay and then that will just go in so this will never get blocked because this will never get blocked but if it ever does it will go back into there so that's it that's how you use the induction furnace and we'll see you next time have fun stay safe bye for now